the... Whoa! Wait. Hey, Karina? Inspired by the show WandaVision, I really wanted to make a cool video in which a living room was split up into three different time periods. I thought it'd be really cool to actually have a practical set literally divided, but that alone came with a lot of challenges. This might be a long day. <laughs> I've never actually sawed into a couch before, so there was a lot of curveballs thrown at me, but I think we figured it out eventually. Granted, it ended up being a lot more tape and staples than we envisioned, but eh, it was for a 20 second video, so eh, good enough. Good. I was able to rent a space that I thought would be perfect for this video, and we were able to load up our van and head down with all the props. Picking out the costumes and the outfits was actually a lot more fun than I was anticipating. As a kid, I would dress up a lot. Spider-Man. I had nothing else other than Spider-Man in my head. Um, a, a different superhero than, I don't know. What else would I dress up as as a kid? Superheroes. Anyway, eventually we were able to find outfits that really nailed the part. Thankfully my wife was really helpful in this department because on my own, well, I mean, I dress myself every day. And we see how that goes. Finally it was time to film and I was really hoping and praying that everything would stay together long enough to get done because literally some of these couches were put together with tape and I couldn't actually sit on it because it would fall apart. Here's a little bit of what that shooting process looked like. Action. I just can't believe we finally got the kids to go to bed. I know, finally. <sighs> oh, the popcorn. Let me grab it. Okay, we're good. Nate, are you yep. static? Yep. You might need. That looks good too. Okay, and then as best as possible. And Nate, direct them if they if they got it off a little bit or whatever. Whoa. Karina. Karina. What? My frame still Nate? Yep. Then I'm gonna go like this. My face is gonna track up here. Boom, down there. Yeah. Cool. Action. Whoa. What? No. no way. Hey what? babe, I brought the puff. I can explain. I felt good. Felt good? I felt pretty good. Let's watch wow. it. After we were done with the shoot, we went ahead and loaded the van back up to drive it to the dump. Now it was time to bring everything to post-production. <laughs> One of the biggest challenges we faced while making this was figuring out how do we get from set A to set B seamlessly without showing the cut or any transition. So I decided to use this moment right here as my wife walks in front of me as a wipe from my first take to my second take. So this is me from take one, and right here as I cross behind her head, that's me from take two. And I used this layer of her crossing me as the transition point. The second challenge we had with this video was making sure the set felt extensive and not just this one little section. So you'll see that the wall itself actually extends all the way out, a fake ceiling has been added for each section, and some artwork as well. So I needed to find a way to transition from performance one to performance two when I go from modern day attire to 70s attire to 50s attire. We had to rotoscope the performance so that we could then warp the performances to match the timing and the exact cadence, uh, so going from one take to the other felt really seamless. It's beautiful, isn't it? One of the last challenges we faced with this video, when I was a 1950s version of myself, I wanted to make sure that the world I was in and myself was black and white. However, I jumped out of the black and white section at the end to only reveal I stayed black and white in the 70s era, which meant I had to be completely rotoscoped and masked out for that section. Once we made the whole world of the 50s black and white, we had to bring Karina back into the world of color. Finally, we went ahead, went back to the popcorn that Karina spills, and we painted it back from black and white. After we had all these effects together, it was time to export, and uh, here's what the final results look like. I just can't believe we got the kids to go to bed. I know, finally. <sighs> oh, the popcorn. Oh, uh, Let me go get it. What the? Whoa! Wait. Hey, Karina? What the? What? World? Whoa. <laughs> no way. Hey, babe, what? I brought the pop. I can explain. Pretty good. Overall, pretty happy with how it came out considering all the challenges we faced on set and in post-production. Definitely grateful for the amazing cast and crew I was able to have for this video in particular. Thank you all for watching and checking out uh, this video. Definitely have more to come just like this, so if you liked it, subscribe. And if you didn't like it, subscribe. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> think, do you think maybe if I like verbally told them to subscribe, they would? Maybe. <laughs> I'm on
minutes. Oh, okay. Ha, 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 ha.